So, that's what I want to say to you. When she represented you in the Senate, a young man from the Pentagon came up to me when I was visiting the Congress one day, long after I left office, said, you ought to know over there at the Pentagon, we know your wife doesn't agree with us all the time. We know she's the first member of the Armed Services Committee from New York, but we do know she knows more about our business and cares more about our people than any member of Congress in either party. She always shoots us straight. She never takes a cheap shot. Even when she disagrees with us, she tells us what the deal is and what she's gonna do. That's worth a lot. You ought to be proud of that, he said. I'll never forget it as long as I live. And so I ask you to support her because I think she's got the best ideas, because I know she's got the best record and is maybe the only person, well, not maybe, the only person left in either party capable of walking into the cauldron of what's going on in the world and making as many good things happen and minimizing the prospect of bad things and making good things happen at home. When it's all said and done, and you look at all of this wonderful diversity, you just think what you really want. 